let us see a question from inverse Laplace transform. We need to find the inverse Laplace transform of 1 upon s square to s square plus 1. So, we know the basic idea of convolution theorem which states that if we know the Laplace inverse of f bar s is capital F of t and Laplace inverse of g bar s is capital G of t then if we want to find the Laplace inverse of f bar s g bar s that is simply integral from 0 to t in first replace this t by u in second replace this t by t minus u integrate with respect to u ok so will you do the same here Laplace inverse of 1 upon s square we all know is t y t because Laplace inverse of 1 upon s power n plus 1 is t power n divided by n factorial and then the Laplace inverse of we have 1 upon s square plus 1 so this will be sine t because Laplace inverse of 1 upon s square plus a square is sin a t divided by uh, a ok so here a being 1 to so sin t by uh, 1 simply ok now Laplace inverse of 1 upon s square 1 upon s square plus 1 that is simply integral from 0 to t first replace this t by u then this t by t minus u du now be careful while integrating so 0 to t now i am integrating so this will be my first and this will be my second function first function as it is integration of sine is minus of cos t minus u then I will go inside integral of minus u is simply minus 1 so this will make this plus minus integral of derivative u with respect to u is 1 then we have the integral of sin again that will give me minus of cos t minus u divided by this uh, derivative of minus u which is minus 1 which will make this plus du so you will get 0 to t u cos t minus u and integration of cos is simply sine but you will divide this by minus 1 so you will get minus sine t minus u and minus minus plus sine t minus u now you will go from 0 to t so if I put t I will get a t cos 0 plus uh, sine 0 this is my upper limit if I go for lower limit this will become 0 and here I will get uh, sine t simply ok now you will get uh, t minus sine t as your final answer so I can finally conclude that Laplace inverse of 1 upon s square and then we had s square plus 1 this will give me t minus sin t so let us look at this once again this was the basic idea of the convolution theorem then we know Laplace inverse of 1 upon s square by the help of this formula Laplace inverse of 1 upon s square plus 1 by this formula then uh, we use the convolution theorem basic integration by part and that gave us the answer thanks and have a nice day